We want to share a powerful story about giving back this Thanksgiving in war-torn Ukraine. Slava Medvedenko is a former basketball star and winner of two NBA championships in his time with the Los Angeles Lakers. When Russia invaded his home country, he picked up a gun like so many Ukrainians. But once Slava saw the impact of the war on Ukraine's youth, he sold his prized championship rings. He used the money to provide counseling and sports opportunities to kids. Chris Livesay has his story. Slava Medvedenko ascended to the highest heights of basketball, winning back-to-back -back NBA championships alongside Shaquille O'Neal and Kobe Bryant for the LA Lakers. But of his millions of fans, none matter more than the ones back home in Kyiv like him Давай, быстрее, быстрее, living in a war zone. But for one blissful moment, the war is interrupted by new basketballs from the LA Lakers and the game they love. They, they kind of forget that that's the war. That's like emotional relax for them and therapy. Until suddenly, the war comes barging in. They united, they, they together, they play. Here we go. Lights is go off. That's it. There's no more light. No more light. Wow. But they're still playing with their they with still some play. flashlights and some cell phone lights. Yeah. Yeah. Amazing. With his nation under siege, Slava put down his ball and picked up a rifle. I make decision uh, uh, to stay in Kyiv, uh, whatever I can do to defend my city. Hmm. What did you see? We see cars, they shooting with, with the, like bullet holes in the cars and it's uh, dead bodies inside that cars. Dead bodies? Dead bodies, yeah. And, uh, and I saw dead people just lay down on, on the side of the road. And these are your people? Yeah, yeah, it is. Uh, and uh, on the cars, there was like big sign. It's like children inside. But the Russians still shoot, shoot that cars. You have kids. How did that feel? That was scary. It was then he understood what really matters in life. People, not possessions. Not even his prized championship rings. What good are they, he wondered, if something happens to me? I am uh, start thinking about that and uh, make decision. I have to sell my uh, rings and then help my country. So he put them up for auction online. He hoped they'd sell for six figures together. Instead, each of them did, netting more than a quarter of a million dollars, a record. I think that's good. We can spend uh, more money on the kids and help more kids. This is where all the shrapnel. Repairing school yeah. windows. And it shattered the windows. Yeah. And school basketball courts destroyed by Russian artillery and sending kids to basketball camps. You played alongside Kobe Bryant. Shaquille O'Neal, you won two championships. What are you more proud of? That time with the NBA or your time now helping with these kids? You know, it's a two different worlds. Like NBA, I was young. Uh, that was my dream to play in the, in the best league in the world. Uh, now I'm more a marcher and uh, I think different. I think uh, to help my country, uh, it's more important. And today, what's your dream? My dream to get uh, Ukrainian free, wealthy, and independent. For CBS Mornings, Chris Livesay, Kiev. Talk about that? sacrifice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, the, the things that you might think are important. He could be here, right. living his life safe, safe and sound, but he's back home uh, trying to help others. And the things that perhaps might seem on the surface to matter don't matter as much when you're facing life. And, and he's life. reminding those kids they have something to live for, a future mm -hmm. they can build and yeah. change. Really yeah. remarkable. But it's so hard to think of just, you know, why, why they're in this situation right. they came with.